Hi, it's Lindsay from the Lindsay Smith Group. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of my Tuesday morning market update. It's my opportunity every week to uh, to blow smoke at the people out there in, uh, <laughs> in Oshawa, in Clarington. As of tomorrow, we've got legal marijuana and I'm standing in front of one of the old pot shops that was busted. So this is going to be legal. So maybe, uh, maybe a doobie on a day like today might take the edge off the rain. We have worked over the past three years with provincial governments across this country to move forward on a regime that controls and regulates the sale of marijuana. Is it heavy stuff, man? <laughs> Will it blow me away? You want to live in here? Yes, you want to be it? Oh my god, I just want to shove it up my nose and have that smell all day. That's amazing. Yeah, for sure. Man. Yeah, for sure. So let's just jump straight into the numbers. In the last seven days, we've had 260 homes come to market. That's 42% more than we had in the week before. So we've had a large amount of properties hit the market. We've had 89 homes sell conditionally, and we've had 97 homes leave the market firm. So we've had 186 properties leave the market sold last week. So an interesting thing that happened over the weekend was I did a couple of open houses, and I met some buyers, and I was grilled by two separate buyers. Where are the schools? Where are the churches? Where are the parks? And specifically, where's the off-leash dog park? How many minutes to the 407 or 401? What's the best place to buy halal products? But I tell you, the, the question that keeps coming up over and over, especially from Toronto buyers, is what are the bylaws around legal based in apartments? It caused me to think about this. If you are a, a homeowner living in Oshawa, Whippy, or Clarington, you want to sell your house, my thoughts are you should be using a local agent. It's local agents that know all the answers to these questions. I could bang those answers off. If you listed with an out-of-town broker, they wouldn't really know kind of how to sell the property. So houses, yes, are bricks and mortar, but people buy because of the amenities surrounding it. If you've got an appointment booked with a local or an out-of-town agent, I'd love to be your second opinion. Sometimes that second opinion can put thousands of dollars in your pocket. I can be reached at the email address on the bottom of the screen or you can reach out to me at 905 area code 743-5555. Have a great week, Oshawa, Whitby and Clarington.